So, uh, Sam, for you, we have a question. How are you working across multiple research studies, agencies, and actors to better use evidence and reinforce community-based programs? Give us a few thoughts in this short period of time. Thank you, and, and greetings from the DRC. Um, yeah, so I, I realize we've had a lot of talk about very um, high level studies and evidence. Um, and here in the DRC, we have multiple actors working on different types of color studies and data sources. And over the last uh, six, seven months, what we've been doing is trying to see how we can all work together to better use that data, um, not only in long term strategy, but also in real time action. Um, so, for example, um, one, we've had three different workshops, making sure that all of us know each other's tools. So when we have a household survey, it's been contributed to by the WHO, um, by Antwerp Tropical Medicine, by University of Florida, uh, by UNICEF, uh, and absolutely by the Minister of Health. Um, and what that does is make sure that everybody can use the same tool and the same data source um, in real time for action. Um, but that's also one component is having all this data that can show us that we see more return of cases in areas with less wash, um, that we see the um, effectiveness of the CATI, so the case area targeted intervention responses. And those are excellent um, in, in, in the medium and long term. But what the data also allows us to do is because we collect and analyze within a 10 day period, we present that back to community action cells to local youth associations and to local Minister of Health level actors. And they can make real time action um, at the community level. So we can reinforce information on access to uh, oral rehydration sites, um, on information on reinforcing healthcare, recognizing if there's some areas where people are healthcare seeking, excuse me, recognizing where if there's some areas where um, communities might, might not be aware that caller treatment is free based on that real-time data collection, we can change uh, communication strategies to respond to that, again, in real time. Um, so our mechanism is to bring all of those actors together to better use the data in real time and to give that information back to the communities as well um, to make adapt adaptations to their community-based interventions. I am also very conscious of time, so I will stop there. Um, but one of the other practices that we do make sure at this approach of uh, integrated operational analytics is that all of our tools and um, data are available online uh, via the Ministry of Health and via all of the actors so that everybody can be using it uh, to define the, 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 the different interventions. Thank you.